so today is, well not today, but we are commemorating the 65th anniversary of Brown versus Board of Education. It's May 17th, this Friday. And so we want to make sure that everyone knows that we are commemorating such a, an, a stellar occasion. The 65th anniversary of Brown versus Board of Education is something that has to be celebrated. We're talking about uh, the desegregation of public schools, public accommodations. And this isn't just for African Americans, this is for all Americans because this allows for everyone to have that equality and justice they're looking for. All right, that's uh, why is it so important? It's, a, it, a it's important today because, you know, going back to the 65th anniversary, not only that, but it's also the 62nd anniversary of Dr. King's give us the ballot speech. And so we know we're coming upon the primaries and we know that voting rights and voting access is also very important. And so in that speech, Dr. King talked about the importance of allowing everyone the access to the ballot. And so we want to make sure that not only is Brown versus Board of Education appreciated, but also voting rights in this country. What, what's the legacy today, Kadita, of, of Brown in our in our public schools? How far have we come since then or not? There's still, we've come great strides, obviously, since the 50s. But there's almost always something more we can do. There is a fair funding for our public schools that's very necessary um, at this point. And so we're fighting for that. We're also fighting for the fact that we have nominees, federal judicial nominees currently, who will not say out loud that Brown versus Board of Education was correctly decided. And so that's a problem when it comes to our federal judiciary. And the fact that Senator Toomey, as we're here with the Tuesday for Toomey crew, that Senator Toomey will also confirm these nominees. He's done so in the past and he'll continue to do so.